The forest air was warm and drowsy and smelt of dusk and moss. Alfred began to feel sleepy and he closed his eyes. Then he heard a voice. It was a whisper. Hisks, shts, psts, coming from somewhere above him to the left. Alfred had spent enough of his young life in the forest to know that this was no bird or other creature or any other sound the windless forest could produce. It was a human voice, a woman's voice. It was too low for him to make out the words, but something in the inflection made him recognise it was a question. A moment later, another voice slightly to the right. And although this too was a whisper, or perhaps more of a sigh, he could tell that this was a different voice and that it was answering the first. He opened his eyes and lifted his head to the boughs above him. He did this out of curiosity, not because he was afraid, being, developmentally, on the cusp of leaving a world in which hearing voices could still quite easily be reconciled with the stark objective realities of life. However, with his eyes open, the voices seemed to dim. He shut his eyes again, opening his hearing to its most sensitive, and then... Of course he's not afraid, are you, Alfred? Alfred fell from his nook and hit the ground hard. He fell, not just because of the loudness and suddenness of the voice, but because he realised at once that the voice had not come from outside, but from inside his head. He sat up and covered his ears with the palms of his hands. Oh goodness, he fell off the tree! Clear as day, the voice ricocheted inside his head, the shout bouncing from ear to ear. The poor boy, he heard. I hope he isn't hurt. Perhaps you should stand up to make sure there are no broken bones, he heard. Dutifully, Alfred stood up and slapped the damp earth from his backside. He wriggled his limbs. All was well. Besides, he had fallen from greater heights before without coming to any real harm. Kss! It was funny, though, how he just plop fell on his bottom. I think you can stop shouting now. He can hear us perfectly well. <laughs>